Hey guys, time for another K Beauty video. Today I will be doing a review slash first impression and comparison on these four cushions that I got recently in Korea. It's the Hera, Shurimura, Belief, and Misha. So I'm going to take off my face makeup and then compare two and two. I'll do like one on half of my face and this on the other half. For those that are wondering what's on my lip, it's the Misha tint. What is, I forgot what color this is in. Uh, cherry cocoa. So let's start. So I took off all of my face makeup. So you could tell I'm breaking out a lot. So first I'm going to compare these two, the hair cushion and the sheer mirror cushion. So I'll apply this on this side and then this on my right side. The first cushion will be Hera. This is in the color C21. It's the age reverse cushion. And this has SPF 38. This is the most expensive out of the four cushions. I think it costs like $60 and my friend bought this for me. And this also comes with the refill. I like the packaging is purple. Try this on. Start this. Oh, wow. The coverage is so good. I feel like it's a little too light on me. And I should have got 23. So I just dabbed this once and I was able to do the whole half of my face. On troubled areas, like right here, I'm breaking out a lot. So I'm just going to apply a little bit more and then just dab it. The coverage is medium to full. I was instantly able to see um, all my redness and stuff go away. For certain cushions, I feel like I still have to use concealer, um, especially for dark circles, but I feel like this gives enough coverage that I don't have to use concealer. It does make my skin glow and it's not drying at all because my face is super dry and it doesn't sit on my um, dry patches. Next, I will try the Shimura Cushion on this side of my face. And this is in the shade 574 Light Sand. And I put the sticker on later. So it comes with this. The applicator is slightly different. And the girl at the Shimura counter told me that the other cushions you apply by dabbing it on. But for this cushion, you have to apply like this, kind of like a sponge. So let's try this out. Oh, so when you press on it, the um, foundation will come up. Oh, downward, I forgot. Did I put too much? I feel like this color matches me better than the Hera. I feel like since they contain SPF, at first it's like super white and then it will kind of tone down to match your skin color. I feel like this has more coverage. It has higher coverage as you can tell when I was applying it. It's thicker than this one. And this side has more of a matte finish. It's more matte than this side. I'm not sure if you could tell, but this side, like it's glowing right here. So I could tell this side is slightly glowy and dewy here. Before I applied this side, I thought this was super matte, but no, this side. This side is matte. And it's not so matte that it's like super drying. Coverage wise, this is like a full coverage cushion. Para, like I mentioned, it was like $60 with the refill. And then the Shimura, I paid um, 
$13 for the case and then like $33 I think for the cushion and it doesn't come with the refill so it was about $40 for this whole thing so I guess the price for this isn't that bad since you get two I really like both of these cushions since they both have high coverage but this is more matte whenever I want to matte finish and then this cushion for whenever I want to look more glowy can you tell it's like glowing right here it's like slightly dewy in certain angles and then the Shurimura guys so the next two cushion this is the belief and then the Misha line collection cushion so let's first start with this belief cushion this is SPF 50 and in the color light beige moisture bomb cushion it's black yellow black That's like a weird noise. Okay guys, so I have it on this side of my face. And the coverage, I will say it's medium. Maybe light to medium. But it's super moisturizing. Just like the name of the cushion says, Moisture Balm. It's the most moisturizing cushion that I've tried, like seriously. Um, it doesn't cover so much, like maybe a little bit. I would say this is perfect for those that don't need a whole lot of coverage, but you want the healthy, dewy look. I think this matches my skin color the best. It's just that I have a lot of redness right now. But it looks closest to my skin color. It goes on really thin, so it looks like I don't even have makeup on. Okay, last, this is the Misha Magic Cushion 21. This has SPF 50 also. This is the cheapest out of the other cushions. I forgot how much I paid, but it was less than $20 for sure. And this comes with two extra cushions, guys. Two. is a little light too light it's weird because sometimes i match a 21 and some brands and then some brands i don't it's just too light i guess because the other cushions that i used right before this it's more expensive i could kind of tell like it doesn't blend as easily as the other cushions i could see streaks to keep blending it um, the coverage isn't bad so the coverage is medium the finish is matte you could tell this side it's dewy slightly this one is just matte I feel like it's a little dual and it does sit on my dry patches like this area you can see it's all dry and then this forehead is all dry and peeling whereas this side I don't see any dry spots uh, this side feels a little more sticky compared to this side I mean for the price with the two refills I think it's pretty good because the coverage is good it's just that um, it's a little drying on me hey guys so out of these four cushions I would say my first pick is Shumura. I loved everything about this cushion. Um, the color match was perfect. I love the coverage. It had really high coverage. It's a little thicker than other cushions, but it's not as thick as foundation. So it's like right in between. But I love that it's slightly thicker, that it gives more coverage 
and I just love the finish. It gives a natural finish. Similar to my favorite Georgia Money foundation, too, is the Hera. Maybe it could have been my number one if it matched my color, if I got a shade darker. I love the coverage, it's medium to full, like it's buildable. Um, I loved the finish. You guys saw how it's like slightly dewy here, but not too dewy and wasn't that sticky. And both of these didn't really sit on my dry patches. Third one is the Belief. I think for those that don't need a lot of coverage, this will probably be ranked as your number one since it gives a really natural finish. It looks like you don't really have any makeup on. And it's super moisturizing. It's weird because the um, order that I'm ranking it, it's kind of in the order that I reviewed the cushions. And of course, last will be the Misha. Sorry. So that was all you guys. Hopefully this will be helpful for those that have been wanting to try one of these cushions. Please let me know down below if there is another cushion that you guys know of and you really like it because I would love to try it also. I'll be back soon with another K-Beauty related video. Bye guys! Mm -hmm.